okay I guess guys thanks for your time um, I know a bit unusual doing a video but uh, let's just try to explain what we're looking for situation is we've got a hotel it's about 130 140 extensions um, they've currently got a um, reseller I've currently got a reseller in there who um, I think pretty much sold the hybrid that's in there into it and he needs to swap it out because you can't get parts for them etc the hybrix um, is sold pretty much in uh, New Zealand Australia Asia what not um, in the US you would have known it as the Transcell communications in the US Indonesia and China etc um, the hybrix slash Transcell is exceedingly strong um, in the hospitality market it was actually ahead of its time um, it was a hybrid type exchange with um, it also had VoIP trunks and VoIP extensions that were done by a card on the back of a PCM type backplane not really interesting but anyway um, so the Epigee matches up pretty well um, against the um, against the uh, current incumbent system but there is one um, problem we've got which is actually critical to the whole workings of the thing and this is a feature that the hybrid has got called an EFC, external call forwarding control. And what this, it's used to manage um, the system remotely when it, uh, in a situation where the building or reception is, is unattended. So um, let me uh, ex explain this through to you. Um, so here's uh, just uh, some simple graphics just to, just to help understand where we're going with this thing. So during the day mode is not a problem. Okay, so it's a hotel. It's um, it's looks hypothetically say they're on the waterfront, etc. If you want an example of how these things are used, they're used in hotels that don't have um, uh, receptionists um, for some reason, saving money or whatever. They just don't have them. They are particularly popular in um, a hotel like in uh, Gold Coast uh, and um, in Queensland, Australia. They um, if you look at any picture of the Gold Coast show, um, showing off the beaches, you'll see these tall apartment buildings. Now, most of those are rentals or accommodation um, for um, short stays and holiday stays, whatever. And there is no receptionist. Um, basically, they have uh, automated everything. So someone walks up, they press a, a uh, access control phone, it rings the call center, and then the call center answers and they can open the door and all that sort of thing. And then they can actually also open up little um, lock boxes with the keys in it. So up they go and into their apartment. Okay, so during the day, simple, but not just you know, call comes in, goes through the telco, and it basically um, rings the operator phone. They answer, transfer the calls, whatever they want to do, no issue. So the next part is the night mode. Now just bear in mind that the reception is not there. There's no reception whatsoever. So this is all done by call forwarding so and this is not a major issue call comes in bounces through out the system selecting the second line and goes to the call center rings the call center and they answer it okay so great there's no problems with that either um, the epigee will do that the next step is the problem so the um, call center has got the um, call and what they want to do is what they currently do is they can dial star and what happens when they dial star is that the um, incoming call is put on hold which is the red line with the pretty alarm clocks and the um, yellow line is basically returning them like a like a tone dial tone um, it, it also will do it with um, a message I don't really care how it does it, but as what it effectively allows is that the call center can now dial an extension number um, and transfer the call to any of the internal phone calls, uh, any of the internal calls, okay, by simply dialing star. So the star turns the external trunk in the yellow into like a, an extended extension using the trunk lines, okay. So just building into that a little bit more the star if they if they dial star once it'll put it on hold if they dial it, dial it again it'll take it off hold and they can toggle okay 
point number one. Um, point number two is that because they can do that, they can um, press the star, get the internal dial tone, dial the extension number, and wait f um, and supervise the call. Okay, if they so want to, or if they simply hang up the phone once the extension rings, uh, it'll clear down the external line and the call will go directly to the internal telephone. That's my problem. Um, I've sat down, worked through um, the system, I cannot figure out a way of how it does it. It might do it, it might not. I've got to ask you guys, um, maybe you know a, a way or a different way to do it. But the end line is that's what we want to accomplish on this, this hotel. You might find it handy in the hotel market. The good way, the way of this is doing it, instead of having like a remote extension, because I know someone will suggest that, is that this is a call centre. It looks after hundreds of hotels and they use uh, simple methods of um, um, to transfer and using the um, the star button using uh, RSC DTMF um, works and it works really well and, and it's simple and it's actually quite applicable to use to other solutions which I won't go into but anyway that's it guys I'm hoping that explains it clearly if you've got any questions let me know um, otherwise thanks for your time and um, we'll catch up later on cheers